Hey, what is up everybody? My name's Star Lord. I hope that you guys are having a fantastic day. I am absolutely loving life lately. I'm so happy and uh, yeah, I'm about to make your day even happier guys because we actually have a brand new weapon coming to Fortnite Battle Royale real, real soon. And I'm talking probably Tuesday or Thursday. It may even be tomorrow, but this is big news. Stay tuned throughout the whole video as we will be talking about it. So please, before we get into the video guys, do not forget to leave a like and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already for more Fortnite videos just like this one right here today. Honestly guys, if you do not subscribe to this channel, you will be missing out. I do money giveaways, I pretty much have every single video up to date when it comes out and uh, yeah, like I said, you know, you will be missing out. Uh, so anyway, let us get into talking about this brand new weapon which is actually going to be yet again another assault rifle. Well, yes, that is right, and I actually predicted this last week, saying that this would be the next weapon to be added into Fortnite Battle Royale. So basically, what you're going to see on screen right now is the new updates page. There it is right there, looking sexy fine, you know, you see that person on the glider up there. But here it says, Thermal Scoped Assault Rifle, coming soon. New high power assault rifle makes it easier to find enemies. And as you can see... This is obviously an M4A1. This is a weapon that is a real life weapon, just like the SCAR or the FAMAS. And uh, yeah, as you can see, it does have a scope. Now, what is really interesting about this is that it also has a grip on the front of it to make it a little bit more steady when you're shooting. Not only that, it has a very large magazine. Also, it has a thermal sight on the front of it, as well as it looks to me like a six times scope. It may be a four times. I mean, it doesn't typically look like a four times, but it could be very well that it doesn't zoom in as much as a bolt action rifle sniper rifle, but it probably zooms in a little bit less than that, you know, so it's, it's going to do some pretty good stuff, you know, and like I said, I actually predicted this last week. I said that the next weapon that they're probably going to add to the game is going to be this one right here or the P90 and it looks like I was right. I mean, now I am going to be making yet another prediction and that is that basically I think a couple of weeks down the line, one of the next weapons in terms of an actual weapon that you can shoot will most likely be the P90. I think that that is going to be a weapon that is going to come out after this one right here. Uh, but anyway, guys, very interesting news because yes, we will actually have a brand new kind of uh, a brand new kind of uh, what would you call it? like a feature in the game, and that is that the whole fact of you will now be able to thermally see people down your scope and what that basically means as far as I believe is that when you aim down your sights let's say for example you didn't know where a person was and you couldn't see him hiding in a bush well basically thermal vision is basically how hot that person is so basically you will see a little red kind of person sitting in a bush and that is how you will actually know that holy crap there's a guy right there behind that bush. Let's just start shooting the crap out of him you know so this is a whole new gameplay mechanic that hopefully may actually be like, you know, th this may be used a lot more in the game now. I mean, it's been leaked or a long time ago that we would be having a weapon with, that's like a rocket launcher that you shoot into the sky, you lock onto somebody and the pretty much the missile automatically shoots down at them. Now, what I'm thinking is that the whole reason of that weapon target locking onto somebody, it would make it easier if they, it like thermally target locked onto them obviously it'd be a bit harder for the game to recognize like where the player is if there isn't like a noticeable kind of red line around them or you know a kind of red outline or whatever uh, so maybe this is actually paving the way for a lot more stuff in the future and jesus how cool would it even be if at one point they said okay listen what we're actually going to do now is that we're going to make the map that we currently have in fortnite battle royale a daytime and a nighttime variant so Basically, once you spawn in, it will always be daytime. And let's say, for example, five games later, you get into a lobby where it's only nighttime. Maybe then things like night vision, uh, night vision assault rifles would actually be like of use, you know. And I'm pretty sure even a thermal vision kind of a assault rifle would be of use then too. I mean, obviously, like of a night, it does get colder, but still, the premise is that you're still pretty hot. Your body warmth is pretty hot. So I don't see why the thermal scoped assault rifle would not work in that kind of situation. Uh, but anyway guys, I'm very hyped about this. I'm very excited that a brand new weapon is coming to Fortnite Battle Royale and I just all around cannot wait to get my hands on this because since it got leaked a long time ago, 
I was very hyped about it. And one thing I do actually want to kind of point to and notice again is that if you look on screen right now at the actual thermal assault rifle itself, you can noticeably see that this actually could be one of the first rifles or first weapons that actually has a skin on it. I mean, if you look at that right there, it actually has like a tiger camo on it. And that's very interesting because not really any of the other weapons have any kind of patterns on them. And this is the first weapon that actually does have that. So, could this actually be the first kind of uh, instance where we see weapons having camos on them, you know? And maybe, even in the future, we may be able to unlock said camos, you know? I mean, they haven't really said anything about that in their patch notes, but uh, you never know. They might surprise us by saying, listen... Camos are available right now. All you have to do is get 100 kills to get the next camo, 500 kills to get the next camo. To get the best camo that you can get for free, you get like 10,000 kills. Shut up, Bowen! Um, you get like 10,000 kills with that actual thing. But uh, maybe then, like, they will offer like paid kind of camos where you can actually, like, the camos are like moving and everything. Like, so you know, you see a rainbow camo and it's kind of like glinting and kind of moving. I would be very, very happy with that. So that's it. Uh, yeah. Very interesting indeed. So weapon camos, brand new assault rifle, thermal vision being in the game now. There's a lot to discuss in today's comment section. So please tell me in the comment section below, do you agree with me on what I've just said? Would you like to see weapon camos? Would you like to see a thermal scoped vision or even night vision be a thing? And not only that, would you also like to see a daytime and a nighttime variant of these web of these maps? I mean, personally for me, it would kind of be a little bit more better, but a little bit more better. That makes no sense, but you kind of get the gist of what I'm trying to say, guys. Uh, but anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching today's video. I do hope that you enjoyed it, and I do hope that you're very hyped about this weapon. If you are, don't forget to leave a like, and uh, yeah, I will have a video out on it as soon as I can. Uh, but anyway, enjoy the gameplay for the remainder of the video. I do hope that you enjoyed it. If you don't want to watch the gameplay, for ado, click off the video now. You don't really have to, but it is a very awesome win, so stick around for it. And uh, yeah, I guess just have an awesome day, and until next time, I mean Star-Lord. Oh, see ya. Thank you.